Hello, everybody. How are you? Hope you're you good. Hope you're doing. Uh, hope you're doing good. You having a good day? I'm pretty good. Uh, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to this wonderful game called Distant Star Revenant Fleet. The developer challenge continues, and uh, we're gonna continue on playing the uh, elite mode, as as we left off. And I actually recently, like very recently, just this morning, just several hours ago. I got more feedback from um, one of the devs regarding the game, and I was told that the pulsar can only emit one pulse at a time. So if I'm if I'm and like on one target ship, so if my pulsar is emitting the uh, like the shield pulse, then I can't use the hall pulse. It's gonna like cancel out and stop the shield pulse, and then like activate the hall pulse and uh and vice versa so uh, that's that's a really good tip because i i was basically counteracting everything i was doing to help myself like by, i was trying to repair my shields when i would stop and repair hall and like i now i i, I know much better <laughs> what to do now and it's gonna be great the only couple of worrying things about this run are uh the the low level of resources we have right now and the high level of danger um, and we have a long way to go. We have at least one, two, three, four nodes to go. I don't know if there's gonna, ever going to be an encounter at an exit node, but uh, we at least have three. No matter which way we go, and we definitely go to go to uh, Cardine, uh, we're going to have to encounter three risky areas, basically. And this level is going to go higher and higher. But no fear. Let's continue on with our newfound knowledge of how the Pulsar works. And the fact that attachments can stack, so you don't have to necessarily scrap them. We're gonna use these two bits of info, and we're gonna see if we can survive this elite nonsense. <laughs> it's just, like really hard. Like it's just craziness. The Akari health stations here are at high alert. The Orthani have hit this frontline sector hard, forcing your allies to mount a retreat. As you jump in from inner space, the enemy comes in for one final push. Without your help, the Akari will be destroyed. Um. So we can we can defend the Akari, the retreating Akari, like right now, or we can tell the Orthani to stand down. Uh, we can we can put the fleet in the way of the Orthani and wait. Or we can let the Akari fend for themselves and and tell them to, you know, good luck and leave. But I think I'm going to tell the Orthani to stand down because I don't necessarily want to involve myself in yet another defending of the giant helpless dreadnought mission. So let's just tell the Orthani to stand down for a second. The Orthani fleet is commanded by a patchy bearded lieutenant, no doubt looking to make his reputation. Exceptional! More beasts join the hunt. Um, these beasts will tear your throat out if you don't back down. You don't have the experience for the fight. Trust me. Ooh, these beasts will tear your throats out if you don't back down. You don't have the experience for this fight. Trust me. Oh man. Well, Apache bearded lieutenant dude. I don't think he will react well. To me telling him that I'm going to rip his throat out. Maybe telling him that he doesn't have the experience might be a better diplomatic approach. When your skin hangs above my hearth, experience will matter for little. The fleets engage. Shit. Well, well. We're so far away. We have to defend both stations? I may just, like, let them lose <laughs> no, i'm just kidding all right select everybody let's move everybody i don't want anybody to get stuck there let's move them smartly cleverly all right i'm already not liking the sound of everything that's going on there um okay mr nightblade you're going to stand like far away like over here you're gonna go over here you're definitely gonna go and just defend up. That base is taking a lot of damage. There are drones coming. There are a lot of heavy, just automatons 
around this. I think it's like about two waves that I have to defend against. However, I have hope. You're gonna get there as quickly as possible, my friend. Let's actually uh, knock down this guy. And my pulsar. Where are you? You're pretty far away. Oh yeah, you are. Yeah, you have to get closer. You also have to get closer. Well done. Well done. All right. Uh, let's let's focus on this guy. Actually, attack this guy. Good job. Attack this guy. Can you move closer? There we go. You attack this guy as well. You also. You're about ready. We gotta we gotta increase the power that we have. This this thing is taking a lot of damage. I might have to use the repair hall on. Can I? Mend it up? Let's see. I don't want to be in the drone zone, so I'll go over there. And you increase everything you have, because we're gonna need all the power we can get. Three, two, one. Alright, let's do the photon attack. Shit, we're too far away. Alright, you have to move a little closer, buddy. Wait, what? No. No, 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 no. No, no, no. You're attacking this dude. You. Yeah, you. You're coming over here. You're coming over here. Shit. You're attacking this. You're attacking this. And then let's see if this works. I hope it does. Photon is going to be on that guy. Wow, that was a lot. It is repairing the hull, which is great, but not for a lot. I have to do it again. I'm really afraid of losing the station. Okay. It's not too terrible. You gotta move again. We don't want you to in the drone zone. We're gonna move you as well. Who else is left around here? Um, nobody entirely over here. Just uh, three people up there. Just two guys over here. Um, yeah. Focus on this guy. Move over here. Maybe over here. There we go. And then you also focus on this guy. Move over there. No, move over here. Yeah. And then you need to also come closer. You're a second away from recharging your lance. Very good, we're gonna use it now on this other guy. Station's taking heavy damage again, I gotta repair the hull of the station. There's also heavy shield damage on, on, on Moon Tiger. I don't know what, the, what Moon Tiger is doing exactly, but I think Moon Tiger should focus on one of these guys now. Are we done with this guy? Almost. There we go. Let's bring our support closer. Our pulse are closer to Moon Tiger so that, um, in case we need to activate the um, shield pulse, we can do it soon. Or I should say sooner than later. But as you can see, I feel like I really do feel like my my people. My fleet is stronger. I really feel like a Moon Tiger is really able to take care of himself, like handle himself very well. And um, also, I think Pufferfish is able to dish out these um, supporting, like working really well as a supporting individual. Sending out these su these supportive pulses, basically, and I think we're good. Just focus all the attack on this guy, and I think I should be going over to the other station like ASAP. Oh, so all the attacks came to this station. Wow, we did such a wonderful job. Quite a lot of experience. I'm pretty happy about this one. Supply. One supply is... What? Warframe has posted in some... Okay, thank you. Um, 
Replenishing any supply is good. One for one is great. Almost 3,000 credits. High Command sends their congratulations. What you saved from destruction today will make the Urthani bleed tomorrow. Very well. Let's jump away, guys. I'm really happy. That went well. I think I deserve a sip of my tea. Alright, next up is going to be this unknown location. No fear. We have this under control. An Arthani force must have deployed here within striking distance of the Akari lines. You have surprised them, but unfortunately, they are still ferociously armed. God! Shit. They're gonna come to me, right? I don't have to go anywhere. I'm just gonna... I'm just going to take all my guys to a safe little corner here and position them the way I want. You come, you're going over there, you're like slightly behind him, and then you like further back. Over there. And over here. There we go, I think this is good. Here they come already. Hello, hello. Um, okay. My dear... Lancer. Wait, he, is he a Lancer or is he like a tech ship? I forget. Can you can you give me your info, please? I, I can't? Really? I think he's like a Lancer. Uh, and you, regardless of what you are, you're gonna come a little closer. You're sure. All of you focus. Both of you focus on this guy. You're definitely going to increase your... Or you know what? No, 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 no. Let's focus on this bigger threatening dude. Who's a gunship? I think this is a tech ship. Because I think Lancers look. Well, well, maybe enemy Lancers look completely different. Um, yeah, this guy, for sure. Increase your powers. Photon blast right on that guy. Let's show him what we got. Let's show him what we're about. It's a lot of sh heavy damage to my shield. Wow. If that's what they're gonna do, I'm gonna repair my shield, like, right away. Wait, go back in there! Why are you circling? Oh my god. Stupid. Let's kill this guy. Um. Next up, let's get this guy. What are you doing, dude? Are you not able to turn properly? Uh, shield. Oh, God. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. We should probably get out of here too soon. Oh wow, he's taking so much damage. Um shield. This guy's not dead yet. Wow. Um you know what? Let's make this guy history. Alright, hit the guy behind him as well, that's great. And this guy is dead. So, definitely way less to deal with, but you're gonna go back on full offense. We're gonna... Get that guy. And you're definitely gonna get that guy as well. Cool! That guy's down. Uh, next up... This big guy? I think this big guy's more more threatening. And he just debuffed my guy, my ship. That's fine. Are you within range? You are within range. Isn't that beautiful? I'm gonna keep you back here. Yeah, this is this fire. Oh shit. Well, maybe it is enough to break down my shields, but I don't I also don't think so. I don't know. This guy's taking a lot of damage to his shield. I may I may or may not. Oops. I may or may not try to replenish his shields but we'll see you are dead my friend oh yes you are you are dead I think we did this 
think we did this, guys. We totally did this. Everybody, attack him. You need an automatic weapon, by the way. I don't even think you have the space for it, though. Oh, yeah. Easy peasy. We got this. Done. Kill all enemies. Objective complete. Tell me. Oh, God. It's not over. It's not over. Shit. Here they come. All right. Um... No hesitation. Oh my god, there's so much. Um, attack everything in your power, guys. Jesus. Um, Losing all my shield over there. Holy balls. Uh, this is this is looking very grim. Oh god, you're losing all your shield. It's awful. You need to you need to help me. This guy's a lot of HP. Get get um get this dude. Because you're going to hit through, hopefully. Is there any way I can get you to replenish your energy faster? I think this fight is going to end very badly. I'm starting to take haul damage. Or heavy haul damage. Oh, wow. Um, we we got to move you. You're going to get disabled? Oh, holy shit. Holy shit. You're in the middle of this storm. You're gonna get disabled too. Oh my god. What the hell is going on? Shit. Goodbye, my friend. You need you need support. Let's hit this guy. Wow, he's also dying. He's also dying. Everybody's dying. Oh my god. We can't lose. We can't lose. We can't lose. Oh, God. Oh, please don't kill him. Please don't kill him. I said, please. Oh shit. Just just stop. Okay. Good. Perfect. Perfect. Um you're getting screwed over here. Bang. You're definitely shielding up. Zap this dude from over there. Oh my god. If I had stayed behind, I would have been so extremely dead.
It's not over. Still not over, guys. It's still not goddamn over. One by one, they come. They're like catching up. They're getting news that everybody died. Poor Moon Tiger is all the way back. We gotta go rescue him. Oh, yeah. I knew there's gonna be more people. We have such a death trap up here. It's amazing. Oh, God. What is this? You're. You're. Jump plating no longer protects your hull, causing you to take hull damage when jumping. Fuck me. Despite their cowardly ambush tactics, these Orthani ships were no match for your advanced battle experience. I must say so. I must admit that I have <laughs> superior battle experience. Holy balls, guys. Um, let's try to get out of this sector alive. And we'll call it an episode. How about that? <sighs> A recovery group has been dispatched to salvage what they can find, or what they can, from the Orthani wreckage in this system. The engineer who grins out of the Vizicom at you is clearly relishing stripping down these ships. Just like Orthon's Jackies, eh? Blowing themselves up at the first opportunity. If it's attachments you want, War Leader, you've come to the right place. I also need to take care of critical damage, which is quite expensive. Um, but I think it's going to be very important to do that. You're so close to leveling up, Mr. Lancer. I would have loved you to be a higher level. And there's also a tech ship that I could purchase. Sadly, I can't. Tech specializes in controlling the battlefield, creating targeted storms. It's a lot of good shield and haul, but I can see how the Lancer is so extremely powerful, almost. Uh, volatile storm generator is only for tech ships. Only tech. No ship capable of using. No ship capable of using. Alright, cool. Okay, let's see what we can use. Ion beam. Fires an ion beam, dealing heavy damage to shields, but minor damage to hull. Um, I kind of don't mind that. Focal beam. Both hull and shield are damaged. Okay. Rush to prayer. Instantly heals hull, but removes 50% of the healed amount over time. It's very good. The music is so intense. The music is uh, definitely adding to the atmosphere and attention. Increases the damage of missile type weapons. And I do have missiles on here. Standard issue missiles. Or missiles. However you want to say them. Missiles, missiles, potatoes, tomatoes, uh, lasagna. This is really good. 10% extra damage. What is this tactical reloader? Increases rate of fire on all weapons. I have that already on this guy, right? Um, this would be very nice on the Lancer, I must say. Evasion module totally uh, disables targeting on your ship. That's really good. Heavy cannon, heavy damage. Burst cannon. Is this automatic? It is automatic. 70 per round, 30 per round, two rounds, two rounds, reload time half a second, reload time one full second, range is short, range is short, okay. Half a second for 60, so in one second this guy can deal 60 damage and in one second this guy can deal 70 damage so for sure I'm going to install this and I'm going to scrap this scrap install thank you and then
And then, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then. I'm definitely going to put the tactical reloader on. Oh, this doesn't go on the, um, shit. I can't put this on my Lancer. That's not fun. I guess, I guess I knew that this would make the Lancer too OP, right? Right? This can go on all ships. So, uh, I think this will definitely go on to you. And the evasion is going to be put onto my Lancer. And sadly, I can't repair my critical damage. But I think it's way more important to make my, my fleet stronger. Spy one supply. Alright, um... Yeah, that's better. They're all like one name. One word names. I was like, Moon Tiger. Okay, guys. We're good. We're good here. Sadly, we're going to lose some haul. Just by jumping. Hopefully very soon I'm going to get to another place where I can do repair on critical damage. That will be great. We have made it to the border of the Zorthani Health Sector. A new sector awaits. Wow. Let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Oh my god. That was madness. You know, I'm gonna go to a front line. I'm not even gonna go to an Orthani controlled sector, because that would be insanity. Let's go to the front line. Your fleet passes into a new and dangerous area of the galaxy. Your charts tell you that many of the systems here have been and continue to be heavily contested by both Ikari and Orthani forces. Major of uh, offensives, counterattacks, and devastating assaults here have laid waste to whole tracts of space. Where these conflicts no longer rage, pirates and scavengers loot abandoned technology from the dead and dying left on the battlefields. Wonderful. I just want to go to one more point or see the, the map. Oh, God. This is a total divide over here. Wreckage field. Sad, oh, some salvageable ships. 110th Intercept Squadron. The 110th Intercept Squadron is well known for its heroism in the Battle of Surazun, amongst other engagements. Code of Logistics Transmission lists them as having attachments to spare. Ooh, what about these guys? The beacon is... It's like a emergency transponder. And then the Plika is an Elgani ship is broadcasting a subspace hail from the system. Unfortunately, this message is so corrupted by background radiation, you can only make out the ship's name. Um, I don't even know what I'm exactly interested in. We're definitely going to go to this point. Let's go there. Let's go there within this episode. High Command contacts you as you jump into the system. War Leader! There is an Orthani strike fleet in your vicinity responsible for the assassinations of numerous Akari Agaktum. Find and destroy them before they can commit any further blasphemy. We gotta hunt them down. Your crew take their stations in anticipation. These are the moments Akari warriors savor. They're pretty far away. Whew, look, my, my assault ship is totally decked out. Isn't that awesome? Shit. I 
have to I have to wait for this guy to stop moving so I can target him properly. Um, yeah, you're in a good position. You're in a good position. You need to move over here. You have to focus on this guy in the back because he's already taking some damage. You can also focus on the guy in the back. There we go. Uh, this guy stopped moving. Nightblade, queue up. You. More power. Hit this guy. You hit this guy. And we're not going to waste any time in repairing shields. So let's shield you. Very nicely done. Okay. What else I'll be facing over here? Some some major gunships. Two gunships. These automatons. I don't know what they're exactly capable of. They let's just check like once and for all. Cannon level two. That's actually not that weak, I guess. But these guys, spider missiles, reinforced shields, patch repairs, targeting override. Yeah, these guys are worse. These guys are craziness, and they have different. They have different weapons and stuff on them, so I have to definitely choose which one is going to be more harmful. Heavy Cannon too. I, I think I've chosen the right guy for now to target. You! You're not attacking anyone. I want you to attack and this guy. You. You're doing it good. You're doing a good, good job over here. Um, I don't know why your hull is so damaged. I guess somebody's firing something at you that damages your hull? Just keep an eye on that. Make sure things don't get out of hand. Nightblade. Let's fire that, that, um, what you call it, fusion blade lance. All of you guys focus on this dude. Guys, shields are taking some heavy damage. Let's repair that. Nice, nice, nice. Alright. Can I get you close enough so that you guys can know? The, the They've already said that the hall region is just single target, so I should... Probably use the hall region, the guy who has hall, less hall on you. Wait. No, you lied to me, Dev. They're multi target. At least the hall is. I'm gonna wait for the shield to regenerate all the way up. Oh, they're coming for me from behind. Oh, shit. Um, I think it's my in my best interest to go toward Fleet A. You should not be getting targeted by anything, and I need you to like move away from that dangerous spot. That guy, what is what is this? Enemy assault, shit. Uh, this is almost dead. You go after him. Attack that guy. You guys attack this guy. They're dealing very, very heavy da damage to me from off the screen to my shields. That's ridiculous. Here they are. It's this one guy, so I can't not take these seriously. Sometimes apparently they deal a lot of damage to you. Alright, we gotta go toward this fleet A and not waste any more time because obviously enemies come at me from like beyond. Is it beyond?
Very unnerving. Okay. Oh god. Enemy dreadnought. Oh shit. All right, you're standing back. You're coming over here. You're st you should move over like here. Okay, you're not going to you're not going to move any further back, are you? God damn it. All right. That's fine. You're moving over there and you're targeting that guy. You're moving over here targeting this guy. You're also going to like target that guy but like move back here. Holy balls, what a good... Oh, shit, there's two of them. You gotta be kidding me. No, 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 no. You go that way. You continue going this way. And you need to go that way. Okay. Um. You obviously need to... God. Come over here. Shit. Get out, get out of zone! I say get out of the zone! Oh shit, you need to get out! Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Shield. Power up. Attack. I should have been doing all of this like way sooner. I don't know why I wasted so much of my time. Attack, attack. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Um, what? You need to be not targeted. Oh, my God. And you need to. Oh, shit. You're dead. You're like dead, dead. Maybe not. Oh, he totally blew up the other guy. You need to attack this dude. You need to, like, leave and attack this dude. Fuck. Because you need to get... You need to get... F uh, right over here. Shit, you need to leave. You need to come over here. Uh-oh. No, no. Alright, um, you, shield pulse, fuck, uh, you, there is too much going on, there is too much going on, I don't even know if this is possible, <sighs> you gotta come down here, buddy. Yeah, why are you not attacking that guy? Okay. More shield. Fuck, we gotta move you. Um, this way. This is not good. Guys, this is awful. Come on. Who are you targeting? Oh shit. Um, get the fuck out of there. Oh shit, I shouldn't have moved. That guy was like glitching or something and now he's on on the move. Um, you be a little closer. 
because you're gonna help regenerate a shield here. You... Please get more strong. Hit that guy. You gotta get away somehow. Um, let's move you away over here. Well, you gotta move right now. Oh, shit. And you're kind of in danger, I think, too. I can't believe I'm facing this many dreadnoughts. And I'm doing it, guys. I'm not losing. Shit. Can't target me. Nana boo boo. And then you, butthole, you're gonna get hurt a lot. Whew! Look how it just completely wrecks the shields. There we go. This is, this is real good. This is real good. More power. Pump it in. Oh, you need... I gotta find something for you to regenerate your energy faster. Seriously. Sure, I'll regenerate your shield. You're untargetable. We we're doing good. <sighs> I think I think that's good enough, guys, for this episode. <laughs> Holy balls. Sweet, you leveled up. We get some supplies. Or one supply, some credits, high command sends a message, well done, world leader. You have left the sector a safer place for the Akari fleets, who will follow you. <sighs> Man. Um, fleet browser, please. Can I, what can I give you? Um, the, the gunnery crew have gained more expertise in targeting the ship's weaponry, increasing the amount of damage all weapons inflict. That's really good. Um, improved shield cohesion. The crew on this ship have found new ways to manually reroute energy base subsystems as the shields are powering up. Increasing the rate of shield regeneration. That's not bad either. Running repair. The crew can now effectively use automated repair systems and vac repair teams to carry out running repairs during battles as hull region. Hull region is very important, I think. Um, I don't know how much damage this is going to be. I think hull repair is going to be very important with the coming trials and tribulations oh my god alright guys we're gonna jump into the system and um, I'm gonna call this an episode thank you so much for your for your time and attention thank you for checking out this video I hope you liked it if you did please leave a like please leave a thumbs up go ahead and subscribe if you want to see the rest of this elite mode challenge of the developers of the game basically <laughs> um, I hope you liked it leave a comment let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Have a good day. Bye.